How's everyone doing today? It's 7 a.m. on a Sunday, and I just got the urge to install a car part in the Z. So I got the RGM clutch pedal, it's right there. And basically what that does is, if you've ever driven a Z, the clutch feel, it's really jerky, all that. The grab point's very all at the top, which makes it kind of jerky and not as smooth as it should be, especially from a sports car. So the RGM clutch pedal is supposed to fix all of that. It's supposed to like completely change the car. Lots of people swear by it. So we're gonna give it a shot and install it right now. Installing the RGM clutch pedal. Now I'm not gonna give you guys like a full detailed rundown on how to install it, because there's quite a few tutorials out there that does a lot better job than I ever would. So that's what I'm following. I'll put the links down in the description of those videos if you guys want to know, but I will give you guys an updated step-by-step -step on what I'm kind of doing just to keep you guys in the loop. So here's everything that came in the box. You got the, the pedal and you got the whole clutch mechanism assembly and then some hardware that we're gonna be replacing. Super simple, we got, we're gonna take out the old one from in there, put this one in and then install this at the end. So here we are getting all set up. Now this is my stock clutch and look how much play that has before it actually engages. Now this new one is gonna completely eliminate that, make it a lot more smooth. Okay, so the first step was to take that Cletus pin, which is right here, out. And the next step is to take, there's two bolts connecting this assembly to the firewall, one right in there, and then one down over there. Now the problem I'm running into is that one right up there? I don't know if you guys can see it right there. But I don't have a long enough extension to reach it, so it's making it kind of difficult. Okay, so I got the firewall bolts off. I found an extension, so it wasn't too bad after that. And the next step is to remove this bottom clip and that top blue one up there. They work the same way. You just pinch the blue tab and they both come out. And then you unhook this hose from the assembly right there. Okay, last thing we did was remove that bolt there, which was holding everything else in place, which is a 12 mil. And then after that, you're able to wiggle it out, and it looks just like that. Okay, okay the next step, what we just did was transfer stuff from the old one to the new one. First things first was this rubber grip. We transfer that onto the new one. And then the two sensors, one that was there, one went to right there. And then we went up top from here, went to right there. Also by the sensor, there's these two rubber mounts that are here and here. And we just put them in the same exact spot on the new one, right there and there. And the last but not least, there is a rubber blue stop that stops this metal from metal contact happening. And we just took that off and put it right there. See, stops the metal. Awesome, should be ready to go to install it now. Uh, to mention before we install the new one is back here we have to take off the cletus fork which comes off right there so we just have to break free that nut and then just spins right off that's because we have a new heavier duty one that we're going to be installing so we put the new cletus fork on and now we we just installed those two little plastic rubber mounts that came with it now we're ready to put the system back together so we just put this new system in, tightened up the three 12 mil bolts, two on the bottom, one on the top there, put back in the connectors, and then we just finished installing the heavy duty Cletus pin right there. Now time to add the pedal. Okay, install the pedal, put it to where we want because you can adjust it if you want more in or out. We did that, make sure all the switches are being hit as we put in the clutch pedal. And one important thing to note is that rod there can't be touched in that rubber outside. So we had to adjust it down so it's nice and smooth in and out, which was done by those bolts right there. Now it's hard. Now we just gotta tighten everything down and we're good to go. Oh yeah. Hopefully you guys can see me okay. Again, I'm just running off my phone in like a cheap GoPro, so hopefully you guys can see me okay. But the RGM clutch panel is installed, ready to go. 
this is the first time using it. Let's take it out for a rip. Now when I started the car, I could already tell that clutch pedal is so much smoother than it used to be. It's, it's kind of blown me away. Like that feels so weird. Because before it's very rigidy. I don't know if it's rigidy, but it's kind of jerky because all that clutch pedal feel is right at the beginning and then there's some lag in between there as well. So what this kit does is help reduce all that so it's like one fluent linear motion. Kind of how like you would expect it to be on a sports car. It just not on this one. It's like already this is this feels so weird. Well, let's take it for a little spirited test drive. Yo, it's crazy. It's so smooth. Right? It's so weird. That's so sick. That's so smooth. Sorry, it's super hot out. Sorry if the window, you can hear the wind noise from the windows being now. But this is just too crazy. But yeah, first impressions, this is awesome. Whoa. Like butter, so smooth. Ooh, little purple. Good morning, everybody. Big bump. Welcome back. Um, okay, so I've had the RJM clutch on for about 400 kilometers now. I have a pretty good idea how it responds. And overall, I love it, it's pretty awesome. It's so buttery smooth. I've had a couple of my friends drive it. One's got a 350. And even he says like huge improvement, one of the best driver mods I've ever done. And my other buddy said the same thing, like big difference, it feels way more premium, way more how it should be than how the Z's come stock from factory. So that's awesome. But it does need some fine tuning. And that's one of the cool things about this pedal is you can fine tune every aspect of it 
to the way you're liking, the feel of it, the pedal, how far it's up from the ground, all that kind of stuff. I have to do a little bit more tweaking to get it to my perfect pedal feel. It's a little too soft for me. I want a little bit more uh, resistance. But other than that, it's going pretty good. I am running into a little bit of a problem though. Um, sometimes on my harder pulls, because uh, I'm tuned with Ecotech, so like a flat foot shift, I don't have to lift my foot off the gas in between shifts. I just, the EC will just cut out the throttle, then when I'm back off the clutch, it'll kick back in. But anyways, sometimes, I've only it's only happened twice, one to me and one to one of the buddies I was driving, but the clutch kind of like, when you're fast up shifting, it kind of like sticks, even when you release, and it's like it's, see that shopping cart behind there? It's just rolling away. What the fuck? Anyways, and the clutch kind of sticks, and like even when your foot's off, it's like it's still on, but it's just like staying in the same rev range. It's really weird. I don't even know how to explain it. So maybe I have to fine tune it a bit more. Maybe that's why, or I'm not sure. Also though, when I'm hard under acceleration, usually before the pedal, it sounds like this. But now it sounds more, it doesn't have that blip in between, it sounds like this. So that's different, I don't know if that's a good thing, if that's a bad thing, I don't know. So I might have to do some research but and dig into that. But overall, it's a pretty good pedal, I'm pretty happy with it. And we just got a new tripod, so we actually do some better stuff, because before I was just holding my hand, it's a little bit better, easier to use. Came out in a couple places, so. And I got a mic, more mic, hopefully my voice is better. Some the, some of the audio didn't turn out all too great in my last video because wind noise and the car is loud itself. So hopefully this makes a little bit of a difference.